We have been planning for a camping trip in Southern Ontario for some time and I have been doing a lot of shopping around going to Canadian Tire, Walmarts, Amazon.ca online and all of that, all of that stuff. Um, saving some money to go to an outdoor camping, uh, you know, in on a budget. So this is my quick video of what exactly you will need when you are going outside uh, for an outdoor camping activity and if you are a new buy like us for a camping trip and uh, especially how can you go on a budget so we'll show you kind of brands we have purchased and how much we spend in general and overall how much it costs for getting this kind of a basic gear to go on uh, go on into camping let's get started this is the first thing we have purchased this is woods true north folding wagon uh, i got it from canadian tire about 139 canadian dollars I've, I've left a video on my channel so i just put a link for that as well you can have a look uh, this is very handy and you know just pull it up like this and it goes nicely in your car trunk this is the first thing and the second thing we have got is uh, these are set of queen beds inflatable queen beds with automatic sort of uh, press pumps and you can press with your legs there and i'm just going to open them i've got two queen sizes they were on sale in canadian tire for about i think i got them very cheap they cost at least 50 bucks i, I know for sure each we got them for 29 and 29 on sale. I just quickly open and show you how it looks like. So you don't need a separate electric pump or inflatable pump for this. And here's the instruction manual quickly, just to have a look. One is this. I think this is where the pump is. I guess. Open it later, and this is the two. So 29 bucks each from Outbound brand. So on the list is our camping tarp. I got them very cheap from Walmart. This is. And I like this brand though, it's, it seems cheap, but everything else which I have purchased from this brand is good. From Walmart, costed me about 13.97. This is medium duty tarp. And this is a large size. And this is like, when I say large, this means, I guess, 9 feet into 12 feet. That is a sort of a large, it's a medium duty tarp. But I felt this is long enough for us to use the size, given the size. The other one we have is about $5.97 from Walmart again. This is about six and eight, six and eight feet, and again medium duty tarp. I just kept two, like one for one tent, one for another. We have a shelter tent as well. I'll show you in a short while now. Items on the list is uh, like a solar. This is like a simple solar, you know, shower bag. Just put the water inside, hang it in a, you know, bathroom or restroom, wherever you want to use it. Like you have a shelter or a privacy tent. And this is where the water comes out quite handy this this is only like 12 bucks from canadian tire and uh, there's no brand though i guess there's no brand in here the next thing is woods like a sink we got this is like a small thing but very i love this thing um, all you have to do is just you know take it out and open like this you get a nice like waterproof sink this is for washing utensils or anything you may want to brush your teeth whatever you like for camping this is quite handy i have got two kids so it will be surely of use to them so that's about this now next on the list is you know all the mosquito repellents so um, just to stay away from those guys we got uh, it's called mosquito coils and i got a nice coil holder as well just to be on the safer side now we'll use it mostly outdoors not inside the tank but this is just a security thing just a backup plan we don't intend to buy a we want to buy a mosquito net but we kind of avoided it knowing that we'll have this instead the related items on the list are same we got three set of this um you know it's called off sorry it's the make the make is called i think deep woods one is for this is all insect repellent it can give you mosquitoes protections as well mosquito protection as well but this is for adults there's one for adults you it says you cannot use it for less than 12 years kids though but i know some people use it and they find it okay sort of eight hours protection and i like the everything online about this so this is one for us me and my wife this is for kids this is this says family and it's deed free so you can use it on kids so just a little safer option for the kids and this is the you know you know an option for uh, having instead of having a full full on like a mosquito net we wanted to have this this is like an area bug spray in yard and deck so basically on the list is um, our walkie talkies you know, just wanted to in case the network doesn't work the mobile towers or if you are out of mobile network range we we've got three sets of motorola walkie talkies costed me about 69 canadian dollars for 
all three of them in one set. These are tent kit and all that stuff. This is a standard garbage bag. We got this like a tablecloth for use on the picnic benches. It just goes in and I've got a nice plug there though. Like you can use this on top of a table and there are clamps. I got like three dollar worth of clamps. Six of them it just goes in clamps. So it's nice and cozy. You can plug and play. Two set of ropes for anything else that, that may come our way. This is the best thing I've got actually like a tent set like a tent kit it has got four set of pegs and one the 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 remover part we've got a dustpan and a millet as well this costed me about 15 bucks this is I guess uh, four bucks each these ropes this is about uh, four or five 4.95 change dollars just a set of table cloth you do get a set of table cloth and two benches bench covers we only got the cheaper one which is like table cloth alone I guess the other one costs more than like slightly around ten dollars or so or a little more than that and then I got these aluminium tent packs four of them just a backup option woods make in case we need extra ones all right guys this is our lighting kit off-road lighting kit and we have got a these things came together these two headlights headlamps or this one torch light uh, Ozark trial make very nice and fine like they say it so military kit great steel or whatever it is so this is about 19 bucks to I think 16 point something all of three together and it takes in uh, there are batteries included so this is I think one or one or two batteries a AAA and likewise you have batteries included in this as well now these are outbound made uh, three set of three like uh, camping lanterns I got it for 19 Canadian dollars from Canadian Tire again uh, they work flawlessly I have put in the batteries as already uh, I can show you this is nice white light uh, these are our all the fan kit basically we use a lot of fan and um, like we are used to using ceiling fans or like a normal table fans in our room so basically one is outbound uh, make costed me about $19 you have a little light here you can turn it on with this switch and a little fan here which is like this so um, you need to four D cells though the old style four D cells so I have them here um, I don't recommend this because given the chance the cost of the fan is equivalent to the cost of the batteries almost but since we got it I'm just going to use it for the first time and see how it goes and I'll keep you posted there from there you can hang it there uh, inside the tent and whatever there are, there are multiple ways to use this but this is a little bigger the other thing we have got is a simple USB fan so you get these cables from this so two ways to use it you can either plug in this USB cable over here and then use a standard USB or a charger or you can actually insert I think um, AAA batteries as well and there's a little compartment there to put in the batteries so this is not very powerful but this is much more powerful from what I know and we'll be using them both for, for the family and the guys uh, this is all our sleeping bags. We got four of them. Two the longer ones for the for the adults and two smaller ones for the kids of course. All Ozark trial made. I think all of them are yeah, Ozark trial. Carried them on sale basically. Uh, it says twenty four. So these are twenty five dollars each. And these are similar or more than that. I don't remember the exact value, but it was pretty much similar, like twenty four or twenty five dollars each for the kids. So I got two sets. Yeah, they look like this. Yeah, 24 again so yeah so so it combined you can say it's hundred dollars for all the four together for a family of four it's all our uh, um, cooking setup we got outbound standard like a uh, gas stuff this is for propane gas tanks and uh, costed me about 79 Canadian dollars water storage for the camping needs I got a reliance this uh, storage tank this is about uh, seven gallons and uh, I like the shape you have a little tab inside it just said you can just take it out like this and uh, this becomes the tab itself so it's very handy to use for drinking water purposes or just to store anything at all it costed me about um, 19 or 20 dollars sorry this one is 16.97 I remember from Canadian Tire again and this one is more user friendly this is again six gallons a little one gallon less than that but this is very handy to use this is again a water tank only for water and this also has a sort of a funnel or you know connectivity inside but um, I think it comes out like this 
and you can use it the other way around if you were to just you know use it for pouring water somewhere else. And when it took a lot of time for us to research, we have been looking for a like a like a freezer or just ordinary cooler for the car. And I have a Jeep Wrangler JL, so something which can really fit into. There's I guess about 40 quarts. We got this from sale, about hundred dollars only. Uh, and yeah, the the most complex thing of everything we have planned is this third fort. Um, Porta potty seat because this was the most difficult to understand. I saw a lot of reviews online and videos and all of that, but this is what we liked because its height is like almost like a natural or a, or a basic um, toilet uh, seat as such. This is the most expensive part, expensive investment of everything else. One expense is obviously the toilet seat which I showed you or the cooler, thermoelectric cooler which becomes a costly affair. But this is where the most of the investment goes in terms of you know, buying stuff. So one we have got is. Woods True North Strong Spruce Privacy and Shower Shelter. We wanted a bigger one for a family, so you have got two compartments. One is for you can put the potty seat underneath there, or a toilet seat. You can use it whenever you like. The little thing which comes out, it has a complex setup, I know for sure. But I'll be setting it up in my camping site, and I'll keep you guys posted on how it looks like, how is the installation process as such. Next one we have on the list is a real camping tent. This is Woods Pinnacle Four, which is like a four season tent. I wanted to be very sure that I don't want to get rinsed in rain. We wanted something which is really waterproof at all, totally. And we got this wood spinnacle four, as you can see here. This is, uh, this can easily sleep four people inside. It's orange in color. We have got this tent and this is a little vestibule which can totally be covered. And after all the research we have done online, um, we found this most useful for us. It can have like four season availability whenever you have to. It can be easily carried on a back. Even if you are just tracker or a serious camper, you can use it. And it has, I guess, the the under the seam flies are great. And underneath you have a like sort of a waterproof la layer or a water resistant layer. Um, I remember it is like 2000 mm thickness coated, which is like highest we could found uh, everywhere else. So all other tents were like um, the Coleman was 600, 400. They are they say water resistant. Nobody says waterproof. And this brand specifically said somewhere online that uh, they are. None of the tanks are uh, tents are actually what 100% waterproof, but you can make them more water resistant. So this has like 2000 mm thickness coated in the in the underneath layer, the, the layer which you will sleep on. Uh, so let me show you. It says rain guard TM here. You see this thing, and it says exceptional water resistance, polyethane coated. Yeah, this is 5000 mm. You see, floors and 2000 mm fly. So basically floors are much more thicker coating than the fly, which is the rain fly. So that's why it's like really waterproof. Nothing can actually come from underneath and the top. So this is the most you can get in industry. I haven't found anything at all which has this level of thickness coating underneath uh, the floor on the floor and only on the rain fly as well. So this is like a footprint made specifically for Pinnacle for this model. So what happens is that this give you additional protection for your uh, the floor. Trecology uh, camping chairs which are very small. You see how small they are. But Guys, this all of that fits nicely. I guess I have planned for it of course. It was not easy. This rack helps a lot. Fully loaded. All my camping gear. Guys, I hope you like this video.